Morning everybody. Um, I'm going to start and do a new thing um, on social where you can message me and ask me a question about woodwork and uh, I'll use me uh, 40 years of experience to try and answer it for you. Somebody's asked me um, what do I mean by pocket hole when I've said pocket hole to them. So uh, this is a pocket hole. Basically it's an hole in a piece of wood on an angle and uh, it's used for joining two pieces of timber together like that. Uh, when you don't want to face fix them through the face here because you don't want to see anything that side and you can put it under shelves or underneath units so that uh, you don't see it so I'm just going to show you how to put one there so uh, this is a um, trend uh, pocket hole manual pocket hole uh, jig we have got also got a uh, pocket hole machine but it's no point in showing you that because it's both industrial this is a handy bit of kit, you can buy it from screw fix or anywhere like that. Um, not, not too expensive, I don't know how it's are at the moment, but they're not too expensive. So basically what you've got, set your stop here and uh, wind that out a little bit so it's nice and tight. That's it. So put your wood in like that. Here you've got two holes, you can adjust them to where you want them. Um, I've just got these set just for an example now. Uh, also with your kit you get this special pocket hole drill bit with a depth stop and uh, I'll just show you there drill two for you better idea so uh, there's your pocket hole drilled now uh, you need to set your depth stop this one's a little bit deep actually at the moment but uh, you don't want your drill bit quite touching through. The reason for that is when you get touched through you, uh, you'll get a bit of breakthrough on the uh, wood and when you put it together it'll hold it away it won't let the joint go tight together so just make sure you, when you set your depth stop I will have to change that one because that's just touching through now and it shouldn't really touch through it should go nearly through but just stop short so that when you screw it together you've got no uh, obstructions no sawdust in here that's going to obstruct it. Now, when you join these pocket holes together, there's a special pocket hole screw. If you can see it there, it's got a flat head, like a pan head. It's also got a square drive. Now you can, and a lot of people do, use normal can sunk screws for these. The trouble with a can sunk screw is, when it goes in, because it's a triangle, you will get it blowing the face off here, because it will just push it out. Whereas these, with a bit of pan head, when you go in like that, they sit flat and they don't blow the wood out. So uh, I'll just show you here. So I'll just put that on there, just for example. Again, drive is a square drive. In your pocket hole screw. And just dip it down. As you can see, that's just one screw. See how strong it is. Really good, strong fixing. Lovely, nice tight joint together, and as I say, you've got no screws showing on the outside edge. So that's a pocket hole. So, uh, any more questions, uh, just send me uh, a question in comments and uh, I'll make a video and try and answer it for you.